Good morning. I'd be lying if I said this was the first time I was waking up this morning, so let's go back. Adam wakes up earlier than me, and even though he doesn't drink the coffee, he makes me coffee every morning. And it's so great. I love his coffee, it's the best. And then Patchouli comes and wakes me up, and Adam tells me goodbye, gives me a kiss, and then Patchouli and I sleep a little bit longer. Now fast forward to when I actually woke up. So I check my phone, it's a bad habit, but I'm trying to break out of it. I'm not really a morning person, but I'm really trying, and Adam and I have been writing each other little notes in this notebook. Since I go to sleep later and he wakes up earlier, it, it works really nicely. Priority is always feeding the little baby. She waits until I say okay. Okay. Like a good little girl. So before I have my coffee, I try to drink at least one, usually two glasses of water before I drink my coffee so I get hydrated. I'm freezing when I wake up. I don't know if anybody else is like that. Let me know. Patchouli's used to us sleeping a lot later, so she's a little out of it. I really can't wake up unless I wash my face and I moisturize and brush my teeth. Here I'm mixing a hyaluronic acid serum that my sister got me with jojoba oil and the two make a perfect moisturizer. Mix it together and rub it on my face. I give patchouli her enzymatic toothpaste in her toy and then I use my Osea eye cream that Adam got me. It's amazing. I brush my teeth, we don't need to see that. Brush my hair and then after I get done brushing my hair, I, I put it back up because I really just can't be bothered. Because I'm not a morning person, I think it's important to really set the mood with candles, turning on the lights, and just making things feel cozy rather than stressful or boring. I, I try to keep things interesting, and I use my essential oil diffuser with citrus bliss and elevation oil. They're both pretty citrusy, which I love for the morning times. There is so much good aromatherapy can do for you. Water number two. Look at that sunshine coming in. If I don't make my bed, I will just crawl right back into it. I wear my Apple Watch, especially on days where I'm editing because I need to know when to get up to stretch my legs. Here, Patchouli is doing her normal guard dog activities until she realized I made the bed and therefore she wants to cuddle all up on it. No morning would be complete without a puppy photo shoot. And I discovered she likes to chase the light from the phone. Remember that bringing in light helps wake you up and I just want to let in every light that I possibly can. Now that I've had my water, now it's time for coffee. And it's been a while since Adam made it so I have to heat it up in the microwave but that's okay. And I use my favorite creamer of all time. If you haven't tried this silk almond creamer, uh, you're missing out. I mean it's the best thing. It's the caramel one. and. I realized that my mug just wasn't gonna do, so I switched it for a bigger one. And I don't know, I've been drinking out of straw lately. Kinda like it. This morning, I decided to do some journaling. I decided to write about how I slept and if I remembered any dreams. I like to stretch and welcome the day ahead and check in with my body. How do I feel? Do I feel sore, tired, loose? And then I write down what I hear, what I see what I smell, and I focus on one word. Today, it was brave. I breathe in courage, I breathe out fear. I breathe in courage, I breathe out fear. 
Today I had to catch up on my devotion that I'm doing with a couple other girls. I don't do devotions every day because I'm an imperfect person. Also, I'm really excited about starting this book. I don't know if you've heard of it, but it's called Girl, Wash Your Face. I just am getting started. My goal is to read 10 pages a day, either morning or night, and obviously today was morning. And then it's time to stretch, time to dance and get things moving. I think it's really important to move your body in some way in the morning, whether that's going on a walk or dancing or stretching or yoga or working out, whatever works for you. But for me, I just love the flow of dance and it's kind of yoga inspired at some points, but mainly just dancing and goofing around. Yeah, the neighbors notice, but I don't really care. It brings me joy. And then I work for a couple of hours. After I've got some work done, I take a break and I take patchouli out on a walk. It's been really cold here in Nashville, so I'm layering up and then off we go. She was a good girl she gets a treat. Honestly, I'm ready for summer. Let me know if you're ready for summer. I'm just tired of all these layers. Take forever. Then it's breakfast time. As you saw, I don't really eat first thing in the morning. I kind of wait for a while because I'm not very hungry right away. Today I made tofu scramble and let me know if you want the full recipe. It's so good. I added broccoli and mushrooms and onion and garlic. And then I did some more work and that's pretty much it for my morning. Thanks for watching.